from May to the end of October on the weekends just about every Saturday or Sunday you're going to find a street fair like this on one of the avenues. Uh, pretty easy to find, there's actually listings for them as well, uh, but sometimes you just discover it by walking around and running into it. These are a lot of fun, there's all kinds of things to buy, all kinds of things to taste, all kinds of things to eat. These are foods that they're not getting like in their hometown, they're not getting falafel vegetarian and, and Latin food and, and they, they, they may get the Italian sausage at their local fair. Or roasted sweet corn on the street. To me the only other place you can get it so good is at the Ohio State Fair. It's fun to see all of the people out walking around. <laughs> what is it about sunglasses that makes everybody want to stop and try them on? <laughs> you know? <laughs> It is a, a great way of also seeing New York and discovering restaurants along the way as well. Here in this area are several of my favorite restaurants. Thalia, which is behind us here, is a really wonderful place to go. Uh, continental cuisine, very reasonably priced. It's a lovely, very pretty kind of nouveau atmosphere inside. Across the street, you'll see the purple rose with the green toloache. This is a nouveau Mexican place. It's not your typical Mexican food. It is some of the best I have ever had. I really love it. Um, they have three guacamoles that you must try. Right directly across the street from them is one of the famous palm restaurants, which is a steakhouse. Um, and uh, it's fun to go in because they have um, pictures and caricatures of all of the famous people who have ever eaten there.